My friends, my friends, what is up? I've been missing you guys. I haven't made a YouTube video for like a week and a half, and that's weird. I took a little bit of a break. I went to Colorado with some buddies, helped out with some other people's hunts, and I also went shed hunting. And now I'm back, and today is a special day because I try to make every day seem special, so to make the video seem more interesting, this little pro tip. But I'm just gonna go check a trail camera. I have a trail camera that's been up on the mountain for a while, and uh, it's been up through all the hunts, through all the elk hunts. I'm gonna go look at it. I'm gonna try to see a couple things. I'm gonna try to see if one, maybe my bull's on there. That bull right there, see him? I also wanna see if my buddy Tyler's bull is on there from a previous video. I got some new mounts up. That's my Utah buck from this year. That's my New Mexico bull from this year. My Utah bull from this year. So it's been a fun season. And now, I'm gonna go drive up the mountain, pull this trail camera down, and while I'm driving, I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of the shed action from this last week, and then we'll go pull a trail camera. You guys, I couldn't do it. I woke up this morning headed for Colorado. I got in my truck, loaded everything up, started driving, and I drove to where I have to either decide, am I gonna go east to Colorado or west to Nevada? And I had to go west. I came to Nevada look for sheds. I know that this is gonna close down here at the first of the year, so I'm trying to pick up all the whites I can before that happens, <clears throat> and I just thought, you know, I've already killed two elk, so there's no reason to go buy that fourth season tag, so I'm gonna come out here and look for sheds. So that's what we're doing today, and that's one of the things I love about this lifestyle, being able to pack up and go where I want when I want. Um, just on a whim today, drove to a different state. I'm excited to go look for sheds. I did really well the last time I was in this area. I picked up one elk shed and a big deer set and a bunch of singles, so I'm gonna see if I can match some stuff up, put a few hours in this spot, and I'll head back home for Thanksgiving. So let's go find some horns. I've been hiking so hard for like an hour tops and uh, it finally just paid off You guys are not gonna believe this giant alert. What? I need to get some ATLs of that bad boy That's an elk shed 100% elk shed still brown. I bet my bet my buyer will give me brown for it. It's barely chalked out best thing about these Kind of like swords. Yes. Score. Hopefully we can match them up. That'd be so sweet. You guys, I don't know what I have here, but I think it's another horn off this deer. I've picked up a bunch of years off the same buck out of this spot. Big heavy buck. And this looks like one of his, yeah, that's him. One of his older years. That's him, it's the same deer. This will be two sets and a single, and I think this is the single that I'm missing. Woo, look at that thing. Big old chalker. That's him, short, but big, big frame. <laughs> that's a good shed. I think that's my missing year. I'm gonna do some laps, maybe it's just another year off of him, but I think that's the one I'm missing. Sweet. Yeah, that's him for sure. Awesome. I have to go put it with those other ones and see. I can't remember if my side that I'm missing is a left or a right. I wouldn't usually be that excited, you know, to pick up. It's a good shed, don't get me wrong, but just the history with this deer is what makes him cool. Look at that mass though. Pretty sweet. And that awesome spike I got, so I'm really killing it. Close to show you how easy you can miss them. I walked right there, and I decided to cut back. And look at that gnarly thing. Look at that base. That's dirty, that is an old, old shed though. Old. I'm here for elk, to keep stumbling onto these deer, which is okay. I'm not gonna complain or anything, but that thing is sweet. Just like me, probably 
the rest of the horn ain't worth even taking home. I'll probably just bust it off of that base because that's cool. I guess I'll carry it out of here. Getting a little pile going here. We'll find some more. Well, nobody's been here in a while. A little big chalky. Ugh. Just became one with the earth. It's a pretty good sized shed actually, but I don't think it's gonna make the trip out. We'll leave it to respect. Out of respect for the sheds that have gone on before. Rest well. Getting further down in here and the elk have just lived in here. This whole hill is just tore up with elk sign. It's all older, they've probably migrated out now. But when I set this trail camera, this whole place was so green, all these leaves and everything. <clears throat> and uh, now it's just, you can, everything's just barren. And all the leaves are gone, so. This, all these tracks in the mud going down. I don't even know. I might have a hard time finding this camera because it looks so different now. It's down in this bottom, like in a big green meadow, but it looks completely like a new place now. So we'll see if I can find this camera. Looks like the water held out through the year. Still got running water down in here. Fresh elk sign all over. And my camera, I think it's. More outside. My camera's right right there. I found it. They love this big swampy meadow. Got a little icy in here. The question is. I'm still taking pictures and video. I didn't have much battery left when I left here. So let's see what it's doing. As per usual, I forgot my card reader. So uh, I'm gonna have to go home, see what's on this card. Um, but you guys, luckily, because of the magic of the internet, don't have to wait that long. All you have to do is just wait one second. And this is what's on that camera. Isn't that cool? All that cool stuff that was on there. I have no idea what it is yet. You guys just saw it. So anyway, I'm gonna go home and throw this whole video together. It's cold on the mountain. I'm gonna get out of the shade, get up in the sun, head for home. Try not to forget the banger. Trail cam retrieved. Let's go check it out. All right, you guys, I did not wrap up that episode last night. Just made a drive home, didn't see any deer or anything, and I ended up back here. And today, I got my editing buddy right here. Say hey, guys. I'm gonna edit this video, get it all thrown together and upload it for you guys and get ready to figure out my Black Friday sale. You guys, Black Friday's coming up and I'm gonna do a deal on all the apparel in the store. All of it. Get a hat. Are you being shy? <laughs> gonna do some deals on some apparel. It's gonna be awesome. So, check it out. There's a link in the description of this video. Get you some apparel for Black Friday. Thank you guys for watching the video. Thanks for following along with what we're up to. More videos coming soon. We'll see you guys tomorrow.